What's up YouTube? Today we're going to go over the average ifs function and all we're going to do here is go between two dates. It's similar to the sum ifs that we used and we're just going to basically teach you how to get an average between two dates based on specific criteria. So we'll go equals average ifs and it finds the um, arithmetic mean for the cells specified by a given set of conditions or criteria. Great. So it's going to do the average function based on what we say. Where do we want to find the average? I click here, control shift down, and then you're going to hit F4, lock it down. Just think F4 is money because it keeps your range stat uh, static. So this way, if you copy this down, you have different criteria based on other things here, then this will always stay the same. You're not going to lose that data, and you're not going to have any problems copying and pasting. So comma, and what's the criteria range one? So where is what we're looking for? These dates. They're right here. Click there, control shift down again press F4, you get your dollar signs because it is money. Criteria 1, now we're going to make it so everything um, from 8-1, including 8-1, all the way to whatever date we specify here, is included. So the first thing we do, quotation marks, greater than or equal to, close the quotation marks, press the AND, which is Shift-7, then you are going to click the date and hit F1, this is your start because you want to do anything greater than 81 or equal to 81. Then, comma, criteria range 2, same process. We're just going to click this one at the end. Click there, control shift down, F4, so it doesn't get messed up when we copy paste it. And then, criteria 2, it's going to be here, except remember we have to do as text, we enter quotation mark. We want less than or equal to. Then we close that add the AND so it's going to concatenate those for us. You could use that function as well but the ampersand is just simpler and I like it a lot more. It's easier for me. Then we'll throw our data in. F4 to lock it down again. Yeah buddy, there it is. So our average sales between here at let's say a child's lemonade stand. Um, let's assume all applicable taxes are taken care of on that. Sure. And 